Hi guys, in today's tutorial I will show you how to make a locked on car rotation effect easy and quick in After Effects. Before we begin making those rotations, we will need to stabilize the video and lock on in the center. So make sure your clip is selected and then hit on stabilize motion. Make track point slightly larger and then move it on a part you want to lock on. In my case I want to stabilize and lock on a car badge right here. I will make inner track point slightly larger to make analyzing smoother and then change some settings from the options here. Let's select RGB and then check adapt feature on every frame, that won't make your stabilization super accurate, but it helps you just a little bit with smoother tracking. Let's hit OK and then click on analyze forward button and wait until analyzing is done. Once it's done, click apply here and then hit OK. Now close tracking window and go back to the main composition. So here I will center the car's badge in the very center of the screen, so I will enable proportional grid from here. Before I center it, I will slightly scale the video to fix those black edges. Now I will drag my video until it's centered. Now I will pre-compose the video. Let's correct the name and then make sure move all attributes and adjust composition duration is selected and then hit OK. We can toggle off proportional grid cause we won't need it anymore. And now let's check if the video is stabilized and locked on in the center and then we can continue with the rotation effect. Looks so smooth and accurate to me. Make sure you are at the very beginning and then press R on a keyboard. Now click on rotation stopwatch icon to create a keyframe and then let's scroll forward a bit and rotate the video something like this. Let's scroll forward again and do the same thing. Just make sure that the last rotation should be 360 degrees. Now let's select all rotation keyframes and hit F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them, then go to graph editor, right click here and select edit speed graph. Now make sure to select whole curve like that and then make it smooth like this. Let's close graph editor now and then enable motion blur on your clip and let's check it. Looks fine, but it's too long in my case, I will show you how to make that effect faster and shorter, but before that let's fix those black edges. Apply motion tile effect on your clip, check mirror edges and then change output height and width to 200. Let's check it one more time. Looks better, but now we have a mirror-like effect and it looks so weird. We can fix it by scaling the video just a little bit until we don't see those duplicated cars. Let's check it one more time. That looks way better, and now let's make rotation a bit faster. Press R on a keyboard and then highlight all rotation keyframes like that and then go to the last keyframe. Now hold Alt on a keyboard and drag the keyframes back until it's enough for you. Let's check it one more time. That looks way better, in case you want to make it faster or slower, just make sure to hold Alt on a keyboard and drag the last keyframe forward to make rotation slower, if you drag it backward, rotation will speed up. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.